Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to get started on your CO2 project. Your sketches, doing some research, and watching some info on how to make your design and referring to the CO2 spec sheet. But first thing we're going to do is we're going to come here to the CO2 blank. It's going to open up your uh, on shape, and this is just going to be a view only file. So you're going to need to click this, make a copy to edit, and let's call it your name and and so what's already done for you is we have all well we have the blank what you're what you're all going to start with we have the hole in the back all right we sketches the side and the bottom which you've already completed some just by hand and now we're going to come in and start with this side sketch and so what you have is we have the hole for our CO2 blank, so we can't cut into that. And then this area right here is where your wheel uh, axle hole is going to go. And it can go anywhere in this, this area, all right? And our diameter of that hole is 0.125. So we're going to start off by making the profile of our car. And there's a couple ways you could do it, and it's depending on what shape you have. I could come in and I could simply, you know, make out for your constraints you know a series of lines like this and this would work because I could put my hole right here and have this shape we can also line envelope we want to keep 1 16th of an inch of meat around this Archer draw, I'm sorry, one eighth. So make sure that we do that. So I'm gonna leave how to penetrate this little box right here for a place to put my axles. All right, so that could be a way I would make my side profile. All right, like this. Let's do it another way. Or, and you can control the work. Here I have a little bit of this caught for as real as possible because that's one of the biggest things to making your car aerodynamic. So that would be using the arc tool. Let's do one more method. Here you crazy kids have all the ways. There's also the spline tool where I do start and I kind of map out the path. Enter, or I'm sorry, escape will end it. You know, again, I can material by now I'm going to leave a little meat around my go to slot. All right, and then do another. Spark. Start. All right, something like that. The green check. All right, now. Let's see what happens if we extrude this now. I select the regions. Angle on this. All right, we're going to remove the thing right now. It's only going through an inch. So the side cut out of my car. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our Now what we have on the bottom, remember, we have a symmetry line because we're only really drawing half of the car. And great lines to go. And we're going to use this mirror tool 
we're going to select our mirror line first. That's our reflected symmetry line. We're going to click on our geometry and it will make a copy of it. Pretty neat. We green check it. Let's extrude it. Last time, let's give it a little angle so we can see what we're doing. We want to remove. Green check. All right. So with minimal effort, I've made um, I'm one of my car. The one thing we need to add now is the holes for our car. So let's go back to the side sketch. Remember, holes need to go in here. And our holes have a diameter of 0.125. So I to be exactly in the middle you could come off of here this now it disappears so we could turn it back on let's hit extrude select one hole select two let's put a little Are with our axle holes and shape that we want. All right, so just remember to use the guide, and don't forget when you're looking at this that you understand things that we can't cut into, like our CO2 hole and our place that we need to put our 